Hey guys, it's Courtney. Welcome to my channel. If you're wondering why I'm sitting on the ground again where I used to film, it's because my tripod just broke and this is the second one I purchased. So I'm going to buy a more expensive one soon. But anyway, this is going to be my What I Got for Christmas 2015 haul and I'm really excited to share everything with you. I got some awesome gifts from my family and my boyfriend's family and I think that's it. So I'm just really appreciative of all of the gifts and their love and everything like that so I'm really excited to share everything with you and I'm just gonna get started because there's a lot of stuff to go through. These things aren't actually things that I got for Christmas I got them a couple days before or pretty recently before so I actually won two giveaways recently honestly I don't know how I won two but I won Megan's giveaway or Meg's Makeup 8 and this is the Polish Choice Berry and Bright Lip Collection set and I've only worn one and I haven't even swatched them yet because I'm not sure how many of these I'm keeping because I'm going to pass them on to probably like my friends because I have similar colors already but I love this one color called Winterberry if I can get this out. Alright so these are what the colors look like up close. This is Winterberry, Plum, Currant, and Sugar. So I've worn Winterberry already. If you guys watched my Christmas vlog, that's what I was wearing on Christmas Eve. And they're just nice lip crayons, so that's what the color looks like for Winterberry. And like I said, I don't want to swatch the other ones because I think I'm passing them on. So it's just a nice lip crayon, and I found that these are really, really comfortable. It's not like a matte, it's kind of like a cream formula. I know in Megan's video, she said that they bled out of her lines a little bit, but I didn't find that was the case for me. I felt that it lasted pretty nicely even through dinner. And we went to Outback, so there's kind of some greasy food there. So I think it lasted really nicely, and it was really comfortable. So I think I'm going to pass these on to like my mom, my sister, or a friend. So... Thank you, Megan, for the giveaway prizes. And then, in addition to that, if I can find the little samples, I got a ton of Polish Choice samples. So they have some for moisturizing, treatments, toners. I used up a redness relief one. So I'm really excited to try all these out because I haven't really gotten into Polish Choice skincare. And then I got this... Polish Choice Lip Perfecting Gentle Scrub with Microbeads. So this is a lip exfoliator and it's filled to about right here. I want to try this out but I'm already working on a little sample of one right now so I'll probably wait to use this. But thank you so much Megan for hosting this giveaway and I'm really really thankful that I was able to win these prizes and try Polish Choice out. I also won Bricklin Nicole's giveaway and she was giving away the Anastasia self-made palette and I actually use it on my eyes today so I really like the box it's like a nice rose gold and black and then the packaging on this palette is beautiful I just love how classy and black it is and then it has the Anastasia little writing on it and this is what the palette looks like So look at those gorgeous colors there I like that it's very neutral but it also has pops of color today I am wearing pink champagne on my lid, deep purple in my outer corner, and then buttery as my brow highlight, and then I pulled in a couple of other shadows. So that's what my look looks like. And I am so excited to play with this palette, and even this brush looks nice too. Let me pull it out. <laughs> ah, it fell. I can pick it up. So it has a blending brush right here, and then it has a nice, I don't know, like sh half shader pencil brush hybrid. So I'm really excited to use this palette, and all the colors look so pretty, and so far they apply super nicely and beautiful. And I actually purchased sh Pink Champagne when I went to New York with Matt a couple months ago in August, and I returned it because I just didn't want to have like a ton of single shadows and plus I didn't have like a case for it so I'm really happy I have a pan of this now and I'm really excited to use this palette so let me know if you want any looks with it I might do a get ready with me or tutorial on it and I'm just so happy to have this palette because it's so pretty I really wanted some new brushes so I went to Walmart and my Walmart near my um, high school it actually had elf in it so I went to that Walmart and I repurchased my elf contour brush so 
it came in packaging like this and that's what it looks like mine's dirty so i apologize for it it's just kind of like a dense domed not pencil brush but it's like a outer corner stamping brush and i really really like it and then this one's a new one that i've only used i think once and this is the elf eye crease brush sorry if you hear my dog barking there's another dog walking he thinks he is a guard dog but he's not so that's what the eye crease brush looks like it's just super super tiny and it looks really really nice for the lower lash line and if you want to put like a really concentrated color in your outer corner and i'm just really happy to have it this is from their essential brushes line and then the other one was from the studio line so this one was a dollar and then the other one was three dollars now on to some stuff that matt got me for christmas in my october november collective haul i actually got an early christmas present from him which was when we got, went shopping on black friday so he did get me something else other than this and i'm very very thankful but the first thing he got me was this pair of vans so these are the gray vans they're kind of like a dark gray so almost dropped it so that's what they look like i don't have any other casual sneakers other than a pair of workout sneakers from nike and then i have like boots so i'm really happy to have these and vans are really really popular and i think they're pretty nice quality i actually haven't owned any vans before so i'm really really happy to own a pair of these and then he also got me Prada Candy Rollerball. He actually bought this for my birthday, but I'm really close to running out of it, so I'm really happy to have a backup of it, and I'll just pull it out so you guys can look at it. So it just looks like this. I'm so happy to have this because this is my favorite perfume, and I don't want to be without it, but I might use up that Rollerball and then one of my perfumes in the 2016 Makeup Collab before I dig into this again because I want to go through that perfume first. And then his little sister made his family and then me this little mason jar and put our names on it and filled it with candy so it has the little like worms on the bottom and mine has Hershey's drops in it and I just think it's so cute and thoughtful because I love chocolate and this jar is super cute and then his parents got me this sweatshirt and it says jeep underscore family on it and it's gray and it has pink on the sides so if you guys didn't know I don't think I've ever talked about this before but my boyfriend Matt he runs an account on Twitter that revolves around Jeeps and it's a pretty successful Twitter so if you guys are interested in Jeeps definitely go follow him I will link it down below and this sweatshirt is really really comfy and soft and I'm just really excited to wear it for like the springtime or when I go horseback riding so it's just a nice light sweatshirt and it's really really comfy and now on to stuff from my family and I got this little holder container and I'm gonna put my brushes in it this is from Marshalls or Home Goods, and it's just white with some rhinestones or diamonds around the sides and I think this will look really really cute on my dresser because I really don't like the setup of my dresser and where I store my makeup so I thought this would dress it up a little bit and it's really really cute I like the white and I love anything sparkly if you guys know me and then I got some socks. So these are from the Sew brand at Kohl's and they're just fuzzy socks. They're purple and then some black with polka dots. And then I also got these socks. These are from the Sonoma brand and they're just nice neutral socks with some animal patterns on them. And I'm not a big sock person, but I don't have any neutral socks. So these will be nice to have. And I love horses. So my parents got me this little mini calendar for the year and it's just a bunch of little horse pictures. So I'll probably put this up at school. And then I got a beautiful day hand sanitizer from Bath and Body Works. This is just a nice apple musky scent. And then this one I'm excited about. This is the Justin Bieber Rollerball in the scent The Key. And it smells really, really nice. I haven't worn it yet because, like I said, I kind of want to go through a couple more perfumes before I pop into my Rollerball. So that's what it looks like. I'm going to smell it again because I haven't smelled it since Christmas. Yeah, it's just a nice, fruity, but kind of sophisticated scent, even though it's Justin Bieber. And I think it smells really nice, so I'm really excited to wear this. I also got this Vera Bradley traveling case in this pattern and it's huge so it's probably going to take over the entire camera and it has a lot of compartments and I'm just really excited to have an actual bag to travel with because I usually if I do like a weekend trip I throw stuff in a backpack so this will be really nice to have and it's pretty big and sturdy as well and I love all the pockets it has and I really like the pattern as well it's really cute and fun and I like how it has a black base and then colors I also got this nail polish from Revlon and it's in the shade Bohemian I think it says 585 yeah 
So it's just a nice shimmery blue shade and I'm really excited to wear this. I don't get nail polishes all the time because I tend to pick my nail polish off. I've been better about it lately, but I just, I'm not a big nail polish wearer. So this is a really, really pretty color. And I like that it's metallic because you can't really see smudges all that well. So this is really, really pretty. And this will be a nice color from like winter and transitioning into spring. If you guys watched my vlog, I showed clips of some things I got for Christmas. And as you saw, I got so many earrings. So I got this pair from Ava and Amelia. So it has the silver background and it has, I think... It has the nice little clips in the back, so I don't have to worry about putting an earring back on them. And it has this little blue bead. And these are really cute, and I think they'll be nice for every day. And I might even wear them today after this video. And then I got these really cute ones from Lauren Conrad. I thought they were kind of different from what I normally like. So these will be nice for on my first hole because I do have four in each ear. So I like to put a bigger one in my first hole. And they're just nice silver with, I guess, like fake diamonds in it. So these are really cute. And these are from Kohl's. And then I got these from Crofts and Barrow, which I think is also a Kohl's brand. And it has some... Um, diamond studs, some pearls, and then these really cute pearl flowers with a diamond in the middle. I think these are really, really pretty. I'm just really happy to have new earrings because I wear the same ones all the time and I tend not to change them out because I just get bored. So I'm really happy to have all these awesome earrings. And then these are also from Lauren Conrad and I'm obsessed with these ones, especially these blue ones in the middle. So there's five earrings. I just think these earrings are so cute and I love blue. Blue is my favorite color and I think I got these ones for my sister. And then I also got these Ava and Amelia earrings as well. And there's some pearls and then these really cute rose gold ones with a little tassel on it. So these are really cute as well. And then the final pair of earrings, I think, are these Napier or Napier earrings. They have gold and a little diamond in it. So these are really, really cute. And I love how I have a nice variety of earrings to wear now. And then I should have done this in the beginning of the video, but I finally found my perfectly posh lip balm. And this is the coconut and lemongrass one. And this is the guilty pleasure lip balm. So it's just a nice skinny stick lip balm and it smells like lemon and it's really really nice so I'm really excited to have found this my mom actually found it for me so my dogs didn't eat it which is good I'm sorry for the lighting change I'm still in the same makeup and outfit but I was filming originally at like 1 30 and now it's about six o'clock and I wanted to finish this video so I got three mini candles I got two of the spiced apple toddies from Bath and Body Works and I think this smells very very similar to leaves and it's just really really cute and I like the mini candles too mmm I just love their candles they smell so good and then I also got an autumn one so it looks like this and then it smells it's like a fresh woodsy with I think a hint of apple fruitiness to it. It smells really nice and I don't think these have the notes on it since they're the tiny ones. I got a giant Hershey's bar because I am obsessed with chocolate and I love it. And then I also got these headbands. These are from the Scrunchie brand and I love using headbands for around the house when I'm driving if my windows are down which probably won't happen for a while since it's winter even though it's like 65 out so I don't know how that happens I don't know but these are really really nice especially for when I'm putting my makeup on so I don't get like foundation in my hair so there's some navy ones green black gray so I have some more headbands because I was running low on them because my other ones were getting beat I got a pair of these Kohl's leggings these are the eye candy leggings and as you can see, they're black, but they have a pattern to it, and these are very thick, so they'll be great for winter. And I like that they're black, but if you look in the light, you can see the patterns in it, so I can still wear it for everyday stuff. And then I got this cute little keychain, and then I'm not really sure where this is from, but it looks like this, and since I just got a car, I can put my keys on this, and I think it's really cute, and I like the colors. It's like kind of like summery colors, because there's like orange, green, purple, blue, that's that and then I believe this is the last one from actual Christmas and then I have two pairs of pants that I got today and these are also the eye candy leggings and these are the same kind of pattern as the black ones but they're maroon and like a 
purpley black color so that's what they look like I actually have two clothing pieces from Christmas this is the sweater that I had in my November and October collective haul but in the maroon version I had a tan version in that haul this is from apartment 9 and it's just a nice sweater it has a nice under layer so you're not like itchy from the sequins or anything even though it's not a very itchy sweater at all I really like it and I love like the pinkish sweaters against not sweaters I like the pinkish sequins against the burgundy and like there's a little bit of black lining in it it's really pretty and I can't wait to wear it I think it will be perfect for like New Year's or Valentine's Day so I'm really happy to have this and I can't wait to wear this and then this is so comfy this is an American Eagle flannel and it's just blue navy and white and red and it's super nice and comfortable and I actually have a red and black one I think yeah I think those are the colors and it's so comfy so this will be really nice to have and great for winter because it's like light but it's good for layering and then lastly I got these two pairs of pants today these are the jeggings from Kohl's and this is the mud brand so that's what they look like they just look like jeans but they feel like like leggings but in between leggings and jeans which are what jeggings are so I really can't wait to wear these I'm excited to wear these because I prefer jeggings over jeans because I like leggings but sometimes jeans can be a little bit uncomfortable so I have these and these are from the mud brand and then I just have a pair of black jeggings as well from the sew brand and that's what they look like it's probably hard to see but they're just basic black jegging pants so that's everything I know there was a lot of stuff and it was a lot of fashion and I'm just so appreciative of all of my gifts and of course of my family and my boyfriend's family and my boyfriend so I had a really really good Christmas this year other than my phone breaking so if you follow me on Instagram I mentioned that but my phone did break so I'll be getting a new one soon but I'm just really happy with everything I hope you guys had an awesome Christmas and holidays if you don't celebrate Christmas and I'll see you guys in my next video talk to you later Bye.